In this video, I'm going to give you the 101 on a vehicle starter, its main purpose, and how it works. Let's begin. A starter is one of the key components in a heavy-duty electrical system. It's the motor that cranks the vehicle's engine until it runs on its own fuel system. You may also hear it called the starting motor or electric motor. These are all interchangeable terms. Sounds simple so far, right? Basically, a starter starts your vehicle. But exactly how it does that is a bit more complex and involves several components that make up a starter. Let's take a closer look. When the ignition key is turned to the crank or start position, the batteries send a low voltage electrical current to the starter IMS. The starter IMS, which is also referred to as integrated magnetic switch or starter relay, then energizes the solenoid. The solenoid is important because it takes the battery's power and makes sure it gets to the starter motor. The solenoid does this by pushing out a rod that is attached to the pinion. That's a small part containing a gear and springs. And as electricity flows through the solenoid, the pinion rotates and moves into the flywheel, a larger gear that's connected to the engine. Then the solenoid completes the circuit from the battery to the motor and starts the electric motor. The motor begins to spin the pinion that is engaged with the flywheel, and the energy produced by the motor cranks the engine and starts the vehicle. Interested in learning why some starters have a nose cone and others don't? How about what an IMS is, or the purpose of a rotatable flange? I tackle some key questions and differences in starters in our second starter video. Click the link to watch that one.